Dancers, it's Noelle and Ainsley, and today we're going to be showing you how to do a mix, mix tutorial. tutorial. It's going to be a two-part two -part tutorial. So the first half is going to be eyelashes by Ainsley, and the second half is going to be eyeshadow by me and Ainsley. Ainsley's look is? Um, my look is for blonde hair and like lighter eyes. hair and eyes. Yeah, and um, it's uh, more purple and gray for my eyeshadow. And my look is for when you like have darker hair and like maybe like green or brown eyes because then I used like dark grays, dark browns, and like a soft black so it like blends a little nicer. Like you can tell mine is like a little darker and goes with my hair and hers is, <laughs> and Ainsley's is lighter and goes with her hair and her skin tone. So all right, ready? Let's get started. So these are the Forever 21 eyelashes. Um, I don't recommend these. They didn't bend around my eyes that well. These are the Ardell eyelashes. These are what me and Noelle like a lot. We recommend these. And then the glue we use is called Andrea glue. Um, and this is just really going to work just like any other clear eyelash glue. So yeah, and you can get these at Sally's Beauty and Walgreens. <laughs> So, when you try to put the eyelash on your eye, if it's a little too big, you can always trim it down with scissors, just a little bit. Then, when you want to make sure you put them on with the small side facing to the... Then, when you put the glue on, make sure you use the brush to spread it ac across the eyelash. But if it doesn't come with a brush, just use a Q-tip to do this. And then, when you apply it to your eye, place it on your eyelash line and adjust. Keep adjusting until the glue dry, dries. Don't worry, you have at least a minute to make sure the eyelash is perfect. So just keep adjusting, keep adjusting, keep opening and closing your eye to make sure it looks good. And if you're having tr trouble with this step, you can have a parent help you. Don't worry, this may take a few tries. You won't always get it on the first try, but just keep trying until you succeed. Yay. Hey, dancers and dancers! We are back with part two, the eyeshadow section. So let's get on with it. So I use the white for like you put it over your eye and then you do like the crease to make like the corner of your eye to make it like pop and then that's your base coat. And then the next color I use is this one for the base because then like the base of your eye then it's like a neutral like soft gray. And then what I do is then in the like under the bottom of my eye I use this to just like line the bottom of my eye and then I use I start using the darker colors, like the br like the darker like gray, and then I start going over with the black in the creases, and then on the edge of my eye. Okay. Okay, so I like to use um this this just like black eyeliner on the bottom of my eye because I am, and on the corner um because to like fill out where um, my fake eyelashes aren't. So I have like you know dark eyelashes all the way around. And then for my bases, I start off with these two. I use this light purple on my lid, just like add a little depth to my eyes because I find if you just layer on grays and blacks, then it looks green. And I put this one like on the upper part, like not on my eyelid, but like in between my eyelid and my brow bone. And then as I go, I add like more depth. So, cause I start off with these two, then I add this light gray over this one on the bottom eyelid. And I add this dark gray over the purple on the upper part of the eyelid and then I like to put this one on the bottom eyelid like on the inner corner kind of so yeah and then usually I like to put this one in the corner like this color I don't know why I put this I always use this white this exact white this is why I have this whole palette just for this white and I put that on my brow bone outro okay guys thank you so much for watching hope this helps you for the Dixon dance recital Check out our other video, the Cinnabon tutorial. I hope that will help you too if you don't understand how to do that. So yeah, all right, peace out dudes.